2025 is a pivotal year for the energy transition of our fleet. This year, we need regulations to close the price gap between fossil fuels and fuels that create real emission reductions based on robust life cycle assessments. This is what the industry needs from the member countries of the International Maritime Organization. We're excited that we continue rolling out our dual fuel methanol fleet. At the end of the year, we expect to have at least 19 dual fuel methanol vessels on the water. We are showcasing that technology is there. We are also looking forward to receiving the first e-methanol volumes from our partner, European Energies Facility in Kassel, Denmark. Looking ahead, we envision a future of fuel diversity with methanol, biomethane, biodiesel and possibly ammonia coexisting. Our journey of learning and exploring continues. Last year, we ordered 20 dual fuel liquefied gas vessels capable of sailing on biomethane. And this year, we still have the option to change the new build specification to methanol dual fuel. Clarity on fuel providers and the regulatory environment will be key for this decision. And we continue to focus on collaboration. We strive to deepen our partnership with regulators, peers and customers to overcome challenges. We cannot do this alone.